What's going on everybody? Welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be starting a new game. As you can see, it is Lord of the Rings Fellowship of the Ring. Um, yeah. I have some memories as this, playing this as a kid. Uh, never got too far, but it was a fun game, so I'm excited to play it. All right. I don't believe this was made after a movie. I think this was made before. I could be completely wrong on that, but on the wiki, it says it wasn't based off of one of the movies. <laughs> but uh, yeah, are there any kind of uh, difficulty settings? No, I don't think so. I share subtitles on. I think so. I think that's <laughs> I think that means it's on. But yeah, Anyways, let's get started. In the shadows of Morgdor, the Dark Lord Sauron forged the One Ring to enslave all elves, dwarves, and men of Middle-earth. The free people of Middle-earth overthrew Sauron, but lost the Ring. Now the enemy has returned, and from his dark tower in Morgdor, he seeks his Ring. We must find the ring first, and destroy it. But who can bear to carry the ring? The weak would be corrupted. Vicious. The powerful would become as great a threat as Sauron. But who can bear the ring? Welcome back, Gandalf. Will we have fireworks, elvish lessons, tales of ancient Numenor? Today, we must talk about a shadow of the past. The ring you inherited may be very dangerous. Uncle Bilbo's magic ring? Magic rings, as you call them, were made by elves. But this ring, I think, was made by another. Give me the ring. No! Look closely. I see fine lines. Lines of fire. In a flowing script. What does it say? One ring to rule them all. One ring to find them. One ring to bring them all. And in the darkness, find them. This is the one ring to rule them all. The ancient kings of elves, dwarves, and men use the rings of power to rule their lands. The Dark Lord Sauron created this ring to rule all the others. When he fell in battle, he lost it. A strange creature called Gollum found the ring and was corrupted by it. Bilbo won it from Gollum, and now it is yours. But the Lord of the Rings has returned. And all his thought is bent on finding the ring. Let's destroy it! It can only be destroyed when it was forged in Mount Doom, the fire mountain in Mordor. Take it there. Take it. No, do not tempt me. If I bore the ring, I would become like the Dark Lord himself. Then... then I must guard the ring. And I will help you bear this burden, as long as it is yours to bear. I'm a danger to the Shire. I must leave. I could set out on the road just like Bilbo. 
My dear Frodo, hobbits really are amazing creatures. But you need not go alone, if there are any you can trust. But take care. The enemy has many spies. Well then, Samwise Gamgee, isn't it? Ah, uh, don't hurt me! What are you doing at Bag End? N nothing, sir. Uh, trimming the grass under the window. Oh? The sound of shears stopped some time ago. How long have you been eavesdropping? Eavesdropping? Uh, there ain't no eaves at Bag End. Don't be a fool. What have you heard? Oh, Frodo, D don't let him turn me into anything unnatural. He won't hurt you. Just answer his question. Well, I, I heard a lot I didn't understand about lords and rings and a fiery mountain. A and elves, sir. I had to listen. I dearly love to see elves. Keep it a secret, Sam. Or I hope Gandalf turns you into a spotted toad. I've thought of something better. He will go away with you, Frodo. Me, sir? Go and see elves and all? <laughs> Hooray! But where should we go? Towards danger, but not too rashly, nor too straight. And you mustn't vanish. Take time to settle your affairs before you leave. I could leave in autumn, on my birthday. Very well, but no later. Make for Rivendell in the east, and seek the counsel of Elrond Half-Elven. East? I'll tell everyone I'm buying a house in Crick Hollow near my relatives in Buckland. I'll have to sell Bag End. The Sackville Bagginses have been trying to take over this place for years. A shame to let them have it. Indeed. And now I must go. I have much to attend to. As do I. See that Samwise Gamgee does not talk, or I will turn him into a spotted toad. You can trust Sam. Oh, yes! Not a word from Sam Gamgee, and that's for certain. Once you leave, travel as Mr. Underhill. The name of Baggins is not safe outside the Shire. And do not use the ring, for it can corrupt the most innocent heart. I understand. Farewell, Gandalf. <laughs> elves! <laughs> I'm going to see elves! Farewell, Frodo. I'll return by your birthday. But Gandalf did not come back, and as the nights grew longer, I decided I might have to leave without him. On the morning of my birthday, September 22nd, I set out for one final stroll around the Shire. I had to say farewell to my neighbors and sell my home to Lobelia Sackville Baggins. All right, into gameplay. Find the bag and deed, sell bag and to whatever, and then something else. Oh, and I looked it up. Uh, this came out a year after the first one, but it's... What I mean, it's not based off of it. I mean, like, character-wise. Like, you can totally tell the difference if you look at this one between, like... Um... The two towers or whatever they're called. I forget. But just the next few games other than, like, The Hobbit. Alright. How do I see... My quests? Right there. Find the bag and deed. Sell bag and to Lobelia... Sackville Baggins get the key to bag end okay is this the bag I need? probably not okay so I get the rock aim probably the rock and then swing okay cool is there a map? yes there is not really the map I was looking for. The one ring is in this chest. I'd best leave it here until I sell back in. I'm just gonna explore the house. I don't know if there's anything in here I actually like need. Yeah, but when I was younger, I always thought this game was really cool, except after pretty much the main the first part of the uh, the game. Like the Dark Riders, I think they're called or something like that. Black Riders. And like the whole forest area, it used to creep me out. So I never really got that far. Oh. Is 
All right, so that's one thing down. Find back and deed. How on earth am I supposed to find that? Is it just sitting in the house somewhere or is it like out and about? Well, let's see if it'll let us leave first. Find the deed. Ah, there's a flower. I saw something that was like different colors, so I wasn't sure. Actually, would it be in this room since this is where the thing is? Hmm, where can this thing be? I mean, I, would, I thought I would, there would be something in here. Not really, it looks like something you can like grab, but you can't. I wonder if I can hit stuff and break stuff. Honestly, if this takes me too long, I will probably just pause it until I find it. Just because I don't want to bore you guys too much. Um, could that be it? No, that's a tablecloth. I also don't really exactly know what I'm looking for, to be honest. What am I looking for, game? Oh, okay. Finally, got it. Okay. Now we can leave the house. Get to see the land of the hobbits. Good morning to you, Mr. Frodo. Good morning, Sam. All ready to set out for Buckland? All ready? Or will be as soon as I tend to Bag End. Lobelia Sackville Baggins is behind the place. You don't need to weed Bag End ever again. I'd like to weed them Sackville Bagginses out of Bag End, if you get my meaning. No, I've got to weed that garden one last time, Frodo. Say my goodbyes to it. Set it to rights before Lotho and Lobelia ruin it. Bag End has the best garden in the Shire, thanks to your work. Uh, no, I I'm sure there are many finer. Oh, Mary Brandybuck said he was meeting Pippin Took at the Green Dragon and invited you to join. They took a long walk out here just for a drink. I wonder what mischief they're up to. Begging your pardon, sir, but there's little mischief to be found in the Green Dragon. The Keeper won't stand for it. We will see. All right. The freaking skybox is kind of annoying me how that is. I wonder if there's a way I can uh, fix that. I believe... I actually don't remember. I know there's a bridge that we have to get to across, but is it just this way? I still don't know if we have to like talk to anyone specific before we get over there. Hey look, little hobbit kid. All right, here's the uh, bridge. Sandyman's Mill. It looks a lot more cheerful than Ted Sandyman. The bridge to Bywater. The same path Bilbo took when he began his adventure long ago. Yes, sir. All right. Uh, yeah, I remember there's like little things to pick up, like th this mushroom, and I don't know if we use it directly or if we have to make stuff with it. Okay, restore 10 health, so you just use it straight up. So I'll probably have to just collect all those that I can. Hello. Will I see another springtime festival around this maypole? This game does not have a far under distance. I think this is who we talked to. Hello, Lobelia. Where's the sheriff? Where's that lazy Robin Smallborough? I couldn't say. Now about Bag End. Never you 
mind all that? There are wolves in the Shire. I'm sure the Sheriff is keeping everyone safe. How could he? I haven't told him about the wolves yet. Go away, Frodo. I need the Sheriff. Just ring the warning bell. If he's anywhere in Bywater, he'll come running. Don't just hang about then. Ring the warning bell. All right. So we're throwing it at this. There, I've rung the warning bell. Now what's going on? I don't hold with reckless bell ringing. I rang the bell. Though Beely wants you to know there are wolves in the Shire. Oh, is that all? I've heard that rumor, but I reckon no one's seen these wolves. Not even Lobelia. Oh, if any wolves approach the Shire, the Bounders will chase them off, just as they chase away foxes and such. I'm glad the Shire is well protected. Now, if that's all, I've got a mug to return to in the Green Dragon. All right. Sorry, just heading back to the house now. Sell bag and to... No, I haven't sold it yet, apparently. Is this who I'm supposed to sell to? Well, someone finally came to his senses and rang that bell. Now we'll have safety and order in the Shire. I do hope so. Now then, what did you want to speak to me about? Make it snappy, I have a lot of things to tend to. It's about Bag End. You said you wanted to buy it. What? But I thought you were lying, you deceitful boy. I believe that when I have the deed in my hand. Did you bring it? Here's the deed to Bag End. I can scarcely believe it! The deed to Bag End! I shall need to remove a few belongings. I'll leave the Bag End key with Master Gamgee of Number 3 Bagshot Row, if you don't mind. What? Gamgee? That dirty potato grubber and his son might plunder all of Bag End in the dead of night! Good day, Lobelia. Yes! Yes! A very good day indeed! My sweet little Lothar will be so happy! Bag End at last! Oh. Why you consort with that kind, I'll never know, Frodo. Having farmers and dwarves and wizards for company, and never inviting your own flesh and blood to tea. Honestly. Honestly. All right. Get the one ring from Bag End. And I believe that is the end of this first uh, little section. If I remember cor correctly. I wonder if I could actually go around and like talk to everyone though. Not that I will, just because that'll probably take a lot of time, but. <laughs> All right. Can you go in here? I feel like I remember going in here. No, you can't. I guess not. And of course our house is the one at the top of the hill. Alright, so I just need to remember the straight shot, like straight down there is where I need to go for the uh, bridge. And that does come important for the next mission. Alright, so we already know where the um ring is. I think it's time for me right in here. and the ring to leave Hobbiton and begin this journey. It is time. Take Ben can't I can't I can't I can't read or speak right now. Take the bag and key to Gaffer Gamgi and number three. I don't know. Um Butchering these names. Take the one ring to Rivendell. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my Lord of the Rings, the Fellowship of the Ring Let's Play. Today, we're going to be dealing with the Black Riders, which we will see in a second. Actually, can I just jump over this? Okay, I was gonna say, I'm pretty sure you can. A rider, all in 
black. No, Mr. Vagant has gone away. Left this morning. Why did Vagant go? Why is none of my business or yours? There's no secret. He's walking to Buckleberry or some such place. Is this place far from here? Yes, quite a ways down the East Road. Never been so far myself. They're a strange lot in Buckland. Can you send a message? No, I can't give no message. Now, good night to you. Master Gamji. Good evening to you, Fredo. A peculiar rider came asking after you. I don't wish to make his acquaintance. Nor me. Sent shivers up my back just to hear his hollow voice. Where's Sam? He was waiting for you. But that dreaded Pippin Took came to collect him. Said they would meet you at Maggot's Farm. Or something about a shortcut. What are they up to? They didn't say. But Pippin seemed quite pleased with himself. And Sam was none too happy about it. He better not be up to mischief. Well, here's the bag end key for Lobelia. I guess I'll meet Sam at Maggot's farm. Good evening, Master Gamgee. All right, Gamgee's a good guy. To up to the black uh, horseman for us. We just have to get to that bridge area. Oh god, I can't jump over that. So you'll see. At the top left, there's going to be like this circle that pops up and changes colors. If it turns yellow, that means they're like kind of close to us or onto us. And red probably means you're caught. I just want to say, these things used to freak me out as a child when I played this game. Like this is one of the reasons I never got far in the game because running around this area would always freak me out. Alright, so we need to get this guy away from the bridge. I think that might be far enough to where we can just sneak past him. This might be a shorter episode, by the way. I don't think this part is like crazy long or anything. Probably just a few minutes, if I had to guess. We're already past the first like third, I would say. But uh, yeah, let me know if you guys have played this game before. I used to enjoy for enjoyed it when I played it for however far I got into the game, but <laughs> I plan on beating it now. I actually don't know if there's any of the uh, writers here. A wolf! I'm done for! Hold on, Robin. Frodo, look out! No, don't get him. Our first enemy that we can fight. What was that, like 10 hits? My purity has increased. What's that mean? <laughs> he has nothing to say to me after I just helped him out. Uh, Fred, oh, there we go. I am in your debt. If you hadn't come along, I'd be a midnight morsel for that beast. I'm glad you're all right, Robin. We've not seen wolves for a hundred years. So I hear. Oh, it's an ill omen. What could it mean? That I'd better get going. What? Oh, <laughs> right you are, Frodo. And I should get back on patrol. Yes, but tell the other sheriffs to watch for more dangers in the Shire. Yes, of course. I'm still shaking from that beast, you know. I have to go, Robin. Bro, the look on Frodo's face there just made it seem like he didn't care at all. Just like, yep, get it over with. I don't want to hear this. It's like his eyes were like half closed and stuff like that. So I guess we could have been talking to everyone beforehand. I just thought there'd be some kind of prompt on the screen that would like say talk or something, but there wasn't. <laughs> you just had to press triangle though. Now we do have the ring. I want to, I'll show that off real quick. This, if you equip it and probably, oh, wrong button. Actually, how do you turn it on? I've never actually used it. Okay, that and then you turn visible. Bro, look at his eyes. That's creepy. You just press sex on it when it's uh, highlighted. Oh, oh. 
<laughs> the facial expressions. Uh, right now is actually a perfect time to use it because. I need to run. Oh God, turn that off. I don't know if you like die or anything when that runs out, but I don't want to test it. Oh, and it limits you. Like that little bar on the right side, it's further down. That's probably what the purity is. Oh God, they're coming. Oh, I was right about to turn and fight that thing. I didn't want to risk staying there though, since there were like three or four there ready to pounce on me. The Shire. Not to pause it for a second. All right. Ooh, is there anything hidden up here? I don't know if this game actually has like collectibles. I don't think it does. I could be completely wrong, but I am pretty sure it doesn't. If you'd know, and if there is, please let me know in the comments. I probably won't go back and get them on camera at least, but. Oh. I swear this used to be scarier. I don't know if it's like the settings that I'm using because I'm using an emulator because uh, my capture card, not a capture card, but the, uh, what's it called? Uh, I can't think of what it's called. The thing that you plug in like an HDMI or whatever from your PlayStation to your capture card, that thing's like not working right for me. So right now this is my only option. Oh, he did go there. I thought I was gonna have to throw another one. Go, go, go. Before he turns around and gets me. All right. Oh. Cool little looking farm kind of area. I always like how this area looked like this and like the back town. I think this is as far as I got though. When I used oh, to play. There he is, the old sluggard. What kept you, cousin? Stopped by the Green Dragon on your way out? Never mind why, but I can't stay. I have to leave right now for Crick Hollow. You mean Rivendell, and we're coming with you. You thought you were so clever, but our conspiracy outsmarted you. We know all about the Ring and the Dark Lord, so we're going to protect you. But how did you know? How could we not know with you muttering? Will I ever see that valley again? You really have the Sackville Bagginses to thank. I was practicing sneaking up on Bilbo one day when he heard Lotho calling after him. Bilbo put on the ring and vanished. We kept our eyes open after that. We spied on you and Gandalf. How? Well, through our chief conspirator. Until he got caught. And Gandalf did say, take those as you can trust. It seems I can't trust anyone. You can trust us to stick with you to the bitter end. We've kept your secret better than you did. But you can't trust us to let you face danger alone. Even though we're horribly afraid, we're coming with you. Or following after like hounds. Dogs! No, Sam. Hounds! Maggots! Dogs! They're coming! Rip! Fang! Wolf! Come on, lads! Then old maggot, too, by the sound of it. So much for stealing some mushrooms before we go. What's all this chatter at this hour of the night? Speak up! Good evening, Mr. Maggot. Well, if it isn't Peregrine Took. And you're lucky I know you, for I was about to set my dogs loose. The most outlandish fellow rode through here, asking strange questions. Here, who's that with you, Pippin? Well, you remember Meriadoc Brandybuck. Allow me to introduce Samwise Gamgee and... Frodo Baggins! Uh. Good to see you again, sir. Baggins. Now, isn't that strangest of all? What do you think that stranger was asking about? He came riding up on a black horse in black cloak and hood, and he asked for Baggins. Oh, that would be a different Baggins. I told him all the Bagginses are in Hobbiton. He says Baggins is heading east on foot, and now Frodo Baggins shows up on my farm. The same Frodo Baggins who was one of the worst young rascals around, I might add. Frodo's much better behaved these days. Where are you headed? 
to my new home in Crick Hollow. I can see you're in trouble, Frodo. You should never have gotten mixed up with those strange Hobbiton folk. I wager that Outlander has come for the gold Bilbo brought back from foreign parts. Well, I think it's time we were going. No, he'll be waiting. You will ride out in my wagon, hidden from sight. Thank you, sir. It's a pity I've been in terror of your dogs. I've missed a good friend. Indeed. Shall we go now? I'll ready the wagon. Farmer Maggot's wagon carried us safely away from his farm and into the borders of Buckland. But the Black Rider was still thundering along the East Road. We decided to go south and cut through the Old Forest. Mary had been in the Old Forest and knew a little of its ways. It's a dark, mysterious place, but not as dangerous as a Black Rider. I just want to say, Hobbits seem like the most loyal, like, best people. <laughs> he has some great friends and neighbors and stuff like that. But anyways, continue. I think that'll be it for this episode, though. So if you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, subscribe. It would really help me out, and I would really appreciate it. Thank you very much. Hello? Mary? Pippin? Sam? Where are you? Oi! Frodo! We're over here. And lost by the looks of it. These trees have a mind of their own. Stay where you are. I'll find you. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my Lord of the Rings Fellowship of the Ring. Let's play. In today's episode, we are going to have to find our friends because in the last one, they disappeared after we got to this forest. It also looked like there were a lot of these mushrooms around the forest, so we're going to have to try to like collect all those. Um, I don't actually know where to go, to be honest. I don't know if I've ever actually made this far in this game. Is this a path now? Am I just like dumb? Like, could I have kept going this way? Where did I go? I don't know. Uh, probably opened up. Oh, there's these big spiders. Get away from me. Okay, I, I didn't count how many that was. I should probably count. I'm coming, buddy. Don't worry. Sound like it was over here, right? Oh, there's one. Hey, Mary. Okay, I was right. So every time it says your purity has increased, that little bar at the top right goes, like, fills up the bar more, so you can use the uh, ring for a longer amount of time. I think our buddies help us fight. I think I actually have been this far. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, eight hits for the spiders. So I think they're a little bit weaker than the wolves. Cause I'm pretty sure I counted like nine or 10 for the wolves. I could also miscount it. They could be the same for all I know. Get over here, spider. Yeah, I think this area used to creep me out too. I think I was wrong in the last one when I said that that was the furthest I've been. Cause I remember being in like a foggy forest set by this. Oh. This one's not that foggy, so... Dude, he almost attacked again. That one was vicious. Alright. Did I find another fan or no? Not yet. I just went in a circle. Where to go, where to go. Uh, I'm so lost already. Okay, I've been this way before. Where do I go? Is this just where I came from? Yeah, definitely. All right. 
Right. Where have I not been? I feel like I do have to go this way. But I'm not quite sure. Okay, that's the roundabout. There is a dead spider here, so I've definitely been this way, but... We'll check it out again. Maybe left here? Okay. New enemies. Ow! Where's my buddy? Come help me! Get away from me! Okay. Okay. Time to use a mushroom. How much does that heal? Okay. Not too much. That uh, sounded close. Okay, here's another one. And some mushrooms. Alright, got Pippin. Now we just need Sam. Right? That's his name in this game, right? Yeah, Sam. I don't know if they changed it or not. Were these guys in the movie? I know Sam was. I don't remember there being these two. I saw you, spider. I'm just gonna go this way. Oh god, wait, 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 wait. No, I, I need to... I need to get rid of one of these guys before I have to fight two at the same time. Okay. Get out of here. Dude, why aren't they fighting? I thought they were supposed to fight. They have sticks. Do I have to, like, command it or something? Oh, this is a dead end. Okay, so I went left over here to get to uh, Pippin. And I'm right in there, so maybe I go the other way. Where this spider attacked. Get out of here. Yeah, that's right. You missed. All right, he has to be around here, right? I feel like I need to pick up as much of these as I can. I have no idea how the boss fights in this game are going to go. Help. Okay, so I'm close. If I had to guess, it's probably to the right where that other spider is. Ow. Hey! He wasn't even attacking me and he hit me. Alright, here's our buddy. Okay, let's watch a cutscene apparently. Potatoes could smell so good. A good meal will definitely ease my mind about this place. But where is this place? Very close to the Withywindle Valley. But we shouldn't get any closer. Why not? The Withywindle Valley is said to be the strangest part of the whole forest. In the center from which all the strangeness comes, as it were. Can you lead us around the valley, Mary? I thought I could, but the way these trees shift about, I don't know. It's it's like they're leading us there. Mary thought he knew his way around this forest. But how can anyone find their way when the forest won't stand still? Do you know one of those trees stuck a branch out at me? Nearly tripped me, it did. I'm sorry I led us into such a dangerous place, but at least we've shaken off that black rider. Anyways, as I was saying, we're gonna heal up real quick. Now we have enough to spare that one. And we can get it right back. Get two of them back. Let's go. Alright. What are we doing here? Go on. Oh, my 
must have nap. It's cool under the willows. Less flies. I don't like this tree. I don't trust it. Hear it singing about sleep? That's not right. It's not right at all. We can't sleep yet. We must get clear of this place. Alright. I kind of assumed this was coming up soon. The first boss fight. Ugh. Back. Okay. Now, okay, so pretty much just don't stand in the middle like that. Oh, okay. There's a vine that comes out. What? How on earth did that hit me? Dude. I don't know how that counts as a hit. Okay, that one I just didn't move. Okay, I need to like, continuously move. Alright, how many hits is this gonna be? I got like, what, four? Oh, I just ran into it. That was my fault. Oh, miss. Reminds me of the uh, Whomping Willow in uh, Harry Potter. Except this guy actually has hands, that one just had like the tree branches that crashed down. Holy crap, this is, what is this, like 15, 20 hits that it takes? Oh god. Alright, there's one half I guess. I just didn't move. <laughs> Come on, that was dumb. Help! 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 Oh, steady there, little fellows. Where be you a going to, eh? Puffing like a bellows. What's the matter then? Come now, tell me what's your trouble. My friends are caught in that willow tree. Old man Willow. I know the rhyme for him. I'll chant his marrow cold if he don't behave himself. You let them out again, old man Willow. You should not be waking. Eat earth, drink water, go to sleep. Bombadil is talking. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. Very much. Well, my little fellows, you shall come to the house of Tom Bombadil. Where? Time enough for questions around the supper table. Come now and help Tom find lilies for fair Lady Goldberry. After that, we shall sit down to a table laden with cream, honeycomb, and white bread and butter. What are we waiting for? The sooner we find lilies, the sooner we can eat. All right. Find 12 lilies for Goldberry. Stay with me. Is there a way for me to command my friends to like fight here? Buddies, I need help. There they go. Took a lot of damage there. Maybe I just need to like wait for them to catch up before I like try to fight anything. Okay, nope, that doesn't work. Run away. Please help. Don't just run around them. Okay, cool. They're fighting. Okay, cool. That actually helped. All right. I'm assuming this is two of them. Yes. Water lilies. Did I say white lilies at first? They're water lilies. Too bad if they don't attack, you know. I uh, see. 
One over here, I think. Hey, 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 hey. All right, this could be bad. Very bad. Where are my buddies, dude? Bro, I'm using so many of these in this forest. Okay, three. None more. Cannot go that way for some reason. Was this one or is this a mushroom? Mushrooms, but I'll accept that. I kind of need them right now. Since I'm going through so much health here. All right. Another one, and then I think I saw some over there. Ooh, another one in the distance. With some more spiders, of course. I kind of wish I did damage to them. Stay away! There we go. That wasn't too bad. Alright, continue up the river a little bit. I feel like there might be some up here. No, there's just spiders that I kind of have to fight now. Stay away from me. Okay, cool. That was not too bad, actually. Went a lot smoother than I imagined it would. Okay, there's no one. How many is that so far? Okay, it doesn't tell me. Actually, I think it's in here. Seven? Okay. This will be eight. Ow. Get away! Alright. Nine. It's gonna suck if I missed one, dude. And I'm gonna have to explore until I find it. Okay, so that was an A, so I do have to actually explore. Okay. Might just knock out this half real quick. Make sure I didn't miss any. That might have been one. I can't get around the tree. No. The little spider buddies over here. Hey, 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 hey. How do you get? Move, 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 move. They can hit the friends because they don't have health. Alright. Was this one or. Yes, it was. Cool. Was that 10? 9? 10 is over here. And then I'd imagine that's this half of the river done. Dang it, dude. Okay, this isn't worth it. Nope, definitely not worth it. As I, said, I was gonna say, as I was fighting him, that this is only worth it if I don't take any hits, but that didn't work out. Alright, off to find the last two. Got some creepy music playing in the background. Okay, I think this half is done. I already checked on the other side of this rock. Probably over here, actually, because I think I crossed before I could actually check out this area. Yeah. This will be 11. Except there's a lot here. I want to wait for my buddies. Wherever they are. Oh, there's two here. That's the rest. <gasps> Run away! Especially because I don't know where my buddies are. I think this guy's by the bridge. 
Dude, where are my friends? Oh, they're, they're there. I feel like the smaller ones are faster. Okay, never mind. Doesn't matter. So it doesn't matter. Dude. Dude, these ones are aggressive as heck. Okay. They're done now. And I got all the little flower things, the lilies. So now I gotta find this guy. I remember seeing him by the bridge. I might be going the wrong way there. Yeah, that's the wrong bridge. Oh, the bridge is right here. Where did this guy go? Oh, there he is. Fair lilies for the fair river daughter. Come, let us go to meet her. Dear folk, laugh and be merry. I am Goldberry, daughter of the river. Here's my Goldberry. You are still afraid, perhaps, of mist and tree shadows. Fear nothing, for tonight you are under the roof of Tom Bumperdin. Who are you? Eh, what? Don't you know my name? It's the only answer. For who are you without your name? But you are young and I am old. Eldest, that's what I am. Tom was here before the river and the trees. Tom remembers the first raindrop, the first big people, and the first little people. He was here before kings and barrow whites, before the elves passed westward, and before the seas were bent, before the Dark Lord came from outside. His precious ring has no power over Tom Bombadil. And now, merry friends, it is time for our supper. We ate our first good meal in a long time, singing songs and telling tales until late in the night. We slept peacefully and were refreshed enough to continue our journey. Keep to the green grass as you go, lads. Don't go meddling with old stone or prying into the houses of old dead Barrowites. Here's a song to sing should you fall into any danger. Oh, Tom Bombadil, Tom Bombadil, oh, by water, wood, and hill, by the reed and willow, by fire, sun, and moon, hearken now and hear us, come, Tom Bombadil, for our need is near us. Thank you, Tom Bombadil. Speed now, fair guests. North with the wind in the left eye and a blessing on your footsteps. Make haste while the sun shines. Farewell, friends. It was a merry meeting. Alright, that'll do it for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. It would really help me, and I would really appreciate it. Thank you for watching. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my Lord of the Rings, Fellowship of the Ring Let's Play. Today, we will be continuing where we left off from last time. Uh, actually, I actually don't know which way to go. I guess we'll see. Do we go past this house or the other way? Let's see the map. I feel like this doesn't help, like, at all. <laughs> Although this might be the right way. It's kind of foggy. My buddy's following me. Or they stay back. Come on, buddies, I need you. It's foggy. Uh oh. I hear a little wolf. It's not so little. Oh, God. Oh, 
Oh, he almost got me. I feel like they're almost like easier than the uh, spiders from the last mission. We'll see though. It's probably a lot harder if you get like a pack on you. So three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, there's seven. Are they easier than the spiders? I definitely would have thought they would be harder. Ooh, I just liked. I need to cool down though on the mushrooms. Like I need to take less hits. I'm like slowly over time using more than I'm uh, gaining. I feel like if you jump away from him, uh, you can just like attack him again right after. Cause it, like stalls them from attacking you. And you get the extra hits in. Good tactic. The barrow downs. Even Tom is cautious about this place. We're not far from the main road by my reckoning. Splendid. If we keep this pace, we'll leave the Barrow Downs by sunset tomorrow. Not soon enough for my liking. I don't trust what's hiding in the fog on the Barrow Downs. <laughs> you don't believe stories about old dead Barrow Whites. Not until today, but Tom said otherwise. Tom is the only one not affected by the ring. I wonder why. He was here before the Dark Lord came from outside. Outside what, I wonder? And whatever did he mean by eldest? And why didn't he serve bacon? Or cutlets? Or sausages? I don't like spending the night among these burial stones. They look like giant teeth coming up from the ground. If half the stories I've heard about the Barrow Downs are true, you'll need to keep a careful watch. Enough storytelling. Let's get to sleep. Sam? Mary, Pippin, where are you? Where could they be? Sam, Mary, anyone? Where are you? Oh no, it looks like we're on our own again. In this creepy, foggy place. The fog here is quite thick indeed. Oh God. Oh, I can hit him? Did I actually die though? How? Run away! Uh, probably not this way, right? Uh, I guess there's a way. Uh, where do I go? Oh, I'm, I'm totally gonna get lost in here. There's no question about that. I want the mushrooms. Give me the mushrooms. Nope, not that way. Alright. Um. Yeah. I definitely 100% think I'm going to get lost here, so it might take me a while. Oh god. Don't want to walk off the edge. Especially if this is where I'm supposed to go. Or should I? It kind of looks like it almost is. Just random mushrooms floating around. This is so creepy. Maybe I'm not going the right way. Oh, I am. Okay. First time. First try. Okay, and now I'm inside somewhere. Sam, Mary, wake up all of you. Who is this guy? What the heck? Get him out of here. Oh my god. Okay, so I guess I can only hit him once. All right. How many hits do you take, dude? I just ran right into that. Whoops. 
I don't know why he's double hitting. I'm only pressing it once. Hey. Is this like another boss? Or does he just not die? Oh. I want to try to go grab that chest and see if that does anything. That was close. Oh, I just realized these guys are here. Really? if I try to do this. Oh, I'm stuck. Oh. So maybe I was supposed to come up here first. Oh, God. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, I am almost dead. I just realized how low my health was. We coming up next. Get out of here. That was a lucky one. There we go. Not too bad. Listen to Tom. Wait. Perhaps Tom is near. Oh, Tom Bombadil. Tom Bombadil. Oh. By water, wood, and hill, by the reed and the willow, by fire, sun, and moon. Hark now and hear us. Come, Tom Bombadil, for our need is near us. Well, little friends, old Tom has answered your call. Get out, old white, vanish in the sunlight. Shrivel like the cold mist till the world is mended. Out into the barren lands far beyond the mountains. Come never here again. Leave your barrow empty. Lost and forgotten be darker than the darkness. Where gates stand forever shut till the world is mended. <laughs> Thank you, Tom. The spell on this barrow lies broken, and no white shall ever come back to it. I've scattered the barrow's treasures. They're free to all finders. Old Tom has taken a pretty toy for his lady, and here are some fine blades for young hobbits who go walking into dark and danger. It's perfectly clean, untouched by time. Yes, thank you again. They were forged long ago by the men of Westerness across the sea in ancient Numenor. They cast spells on their blades for the bane of the Dark Lord. Their kings of Numenor are forgotten now, but their sons wander in loneliness, guarding simple folk from wicked things. I wonder if this blade can hurt one of the Black Riders. Old Tom shall see you safe over the borders of his land. From there you should travel to Bree, a fair village. Stay the night at the Prancing Pony Inn. Fair advice. Lead the way. Ready to follow Tom, then? Indeed. The further we are from the barrows, the better. Let us speed on our way. We left the cold stone fields of the Barrow Downs and arrived at the hillside village of Bree, home to both hobbits and big folk. We said goodbye to Tom and entered Bree, seeking a warm fire and a door between us and the night. At last, we found a cheerful inn with the sign of the Prancing Pony. We surely aren't staying in this inn, are we? Why not? 
Tom recommended it. I thought we might see about staying with some of the Bree hobbits. It'd be more home-like. Oh, Sam. This is as good as an inn back home. Just a lot larger. The larger the inn, the larger the meals. Don't worry, Sam. This will be fine. Maybe Sam can find a tater patch to sleep in. I'll make arrangements with the innkeeper while you three find something to eat. And remember, from now on, my name is Mr. Underhill. Right. Come on, Sam. Pippin. Uh, goodbye, Mr. Underhill. Alright, that's under that level, so that'll do for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my Lord of the Rings Fellowship of the Ring Let's Play. Uh, yeah, it's been about a week since I played this, so I don't exactly remember where we are, what we're doing, but uh, let's get right into the game. Can I talk to you guys? Hey, what do you want, fatty? Excuse me? Why don't you go stand by the fire with the rest of the children? Bill Fernie's trying to relax. Bruh, I'm not even fat. Look at me. Am I even going to talk to you? I don't like you hobbits much. Go away. Well, I don't like you either. Good evening to you. Pleased to meet you. My name is Underhill. Is this your first time in an inn, Mr. Underhill? No, that is to say, it's my first time in this inn. <laughs> I see. Well, if you're planning on staying here, you should check with the innkeep. Wait too long and you'll be sleeping in the stables. Right. Thank you for the advice. We should have come here long ago. Good food and excellent drink. Don't get too comfortable. Things could change. I'll worry about that when the time comes. Until then, I shall rest my weary feet and enjoy the local hospitality. I still don't like the look of this place. We'll be gone soon enough, Sam. Don't worry. That is my worry if you follow me, sir. We'll be gone. Gone for good. Okay, um, let's see what the, the uh, quest that popped up was. Oh, it says at the bottom. Check in at the Prancing Pony Inn. And I also saw this open, like, does it want me to go through there? No, nah, okay. Just curious. Alright, so I gotta check in. Did I, like, pass someone? Oh, I swear this guy wasn't there before. Hello? I'd like to... Half a minute, if you please. Nob? Where are you? With customers. Step lively. Now then, good evening, little master. Balaman Butterbur at your service. What may you be wanting? Room for four, please. You're from the Shire, from the Sandia. We don't get many from the Shire nowadays. Shire. Now, what does that remind me of? Might I ask your name? Mr. Underhill. I'm run off my feet with all these travelers tonight. There's a crowd in the house tonight as there hasn't been in long years. Lucky you're a hobbit. That's the only kind of room we have left. Here's your key, then. Nob! Nob, you woolly-footed slow coach. Where are you? Here, sir. Here I am. Where's Bob? Find him double sharp. He's got some ponies to stable straight away. I'll get right on it, sir. You'll excuse me, sir, but I've a party of dwarves to tend to and all these strangers coming up the greenway from the south. Busy days, these. All right. I go upstairs yet? No, I can't. All right, now what do I do? Was this open before? No, I don't think so. It's a little sitting room here. Okay, um, I mean, I'm guessing we just have to find a room, but you don't, never know. Okay, these look like hobbit rooms. Um, okay, what does it want me to do? I have to like go get my friends or something? <laughs> the 
Well, it was the best party ever. Fireworks that only a wizard could make. <laughs> Old Bilbo starts a long, boring speech, but he has a trick up his sleeve. <laughs> or in his pocket. Mr. Underhill, I'd ever. stop your friend from Fireworks talking if I were you. <laughs> so Bilbo says to the 144 hobbits at the party, you are one gross of hobbits. <laughs> Everyone's so offended, they don't see his hand go into his pocket. You'd better do something <laughs> so quick. People of Bree, thank you for your gracious reception. <laughs> Let's have a song. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I'm getting to the good part. Very well, then. A song. There is an inn, a merry old inn, beneath an old grey hill. And there they make a stew so brown that the man in the moon himself flew down at night to eat his fill. Uh, uh, oh. Where did he go? Sorcery! Bah! Conjurer's trick, that's all. <laughs> right, and a fine trick it was! What you did was worse than anything your friend could have said. It was an accident. I want a word with you somewhere quiet. Hello. Who are you? And uh, what do you want? I am called Strider, and if what I say is helpful to you, I want you to take me with you. I would not agree to any such thing until I knew a lot more about you. Excellent. You seem to be coming to your senses again after your accident. Begging your pardon, I need a word. Everyone in this place needs a word. I remembered what it was I forgot. What? About a shire hobbit named Baggins, but called Underhill. Who told you this? Gandalf the wizard. He asked me to send this letter to you in the Shire, but I forgot. I expect he'll turn me into a block of wood. Dear Frodo, bad news. You must leave for Rivendell before the end of July. Do not wait for your birthday. I will meet you if I can, or follow you if I can't. You can trust the ranger called Strider, but make sure he's the real Strider. His true name is Aragorn. I am Aragorn son of Arathorn, and if by life or death I can save you, I will. I thought I would have to persuade you without proof, but my looks are against me. I believed you, or I wanted to. The enemy spies look fair but feel foul, while you feel fair... But look foul? <laughs> Hold on. Where's Mary? He's still not back from his walk. Stay here. I'll find him. Ooh, did not know we got to play as him in this game. What, Aragon? Is that right? I don't know my whole uh, Lord of the Rings. I know they just said it. But I was like half paying attention. I really need to pay attention more during like cutscenes and games. <laughs> Sorry, sir. The stables are all closed off. I got to get them clean before the boss has my hide. All right. Okay, cool. I get a sword and his bow. Let's go. That's so cool. I wonder if I'll be able to play as like Gandalf then, if they do let you play other characters. All right. Yeah, I've never been this far in this game, so I have no idea where to look or go. So I apologize if I end up getting lost or take forever to find stuff. I, I just had to kick it. It's <laughs> pressing triangle on it. And I'm just assuming that's like... How do I do it? Okay, I like... There we go. Part two. Okay, I have 30 health. It's been a week, so I kind of forgot the controls already. I really like how this town looks though. It's cute. What do you want, long shanks? None of your concern, horse thief. What? You're gonna call me a horse thief? I already have. Now be gone. You've stuck your nose in the wrong place. I've seen you talking to the Shire Rats. You want the reward for baggins all to yourself. But you won't get it. Get out of here. I got a sword. 
Okay, so two hits and then he blocks. Not that time. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that was cool. I don't know how I did that. Oh, he's not dead? Or is this a different guy? Okay, no, the same guy. He just didn't die the first time. What does it say my quest is right now? Just search the village? Okay. Didn't know if I had to do anything else. I almost just passed it. Ah, there you are, Mary. Who are you? They call me Strider. I am a friend of Gandalf. Very well, friend. What should we do now? Return to the inn and find your friends. Tell Butterbur to lodge you in my quarters. What about you? I think it's time to throw these enemies off the scent. Beg your pardon? I'm going to collect some items to make decoys of you hobbits. You'll see. You must come with me. I'll see you safely back to the inn. I do appreciate it. These streets have suddenly become rather unfriendly. Come along. All right, got some little wolfies to fight. I wonder if I do more damage with this guy, since he has like an actual sword instead of just like a little stick. <laughs> collect clothes, collect melons, collect hay, bolsters, and collect small logs. Okay. Okay, so I think that was less hits. Oh, no. Don't kick. Okay, cool. Not too bad. Um, I was gonna be kind of kind of disappointed if we had to go back already, though. So I'm happy we have to search around for stuff. Hold. What are you doing out here? That's my business. It's my business now. You'll beg to tell me after my friends work you over. I took out your uh, little wolf buddies. Ow! <laughs> Stay down. <laughs> this is so much better with like a way to help. Oh, this guy has a lot of health. There we go. Lambda, what? Oh, that's pretty good. Completely fills up your health. Alright, so we got one thing there. I'm assuming we have to go back and to the right. Although there's something right there too. Yeah, I'm thinking there's stuff down there. Whoops. I'm sorry, Wolfies. I don't want to hurt you, but I have to. Um... Where to go? Where to go? Can we go inside buildings? No. Actually, I didn't really press anything, so I don't know, but... Cram. Okay, so I got two of the things, right? So melons and hay bolsters. Um, that might be in that far little corner that I went to before. Before I found, uh, Mary. Why is it red? Oh, that's why. I was thinking something was gonna like jump out of me. Oh, I probably have to go over there to the stables too. For the hay. Uh, let's do that now. Talk, you little mouse. Talk or I'll make you squeak. I don't know, no baggins. I swear it. Little mousey's about to get his airy foot in a rat trap. Bold words for a filthy orc son of Mordor. Ah, I'll make you squeak too, wanderer. Mordor, where's my little buddy, Mary? There we go. <laughs> Bro, I 
want my little hobbit buddy with me. Makes fighting these guys easier. Oh, did that finish him? Please tell me that finished him. Ow. Ow. Okay, I'm gonna take like one more hit and then heal. Okay, that was wasted hits, but I got him. Okay, um, I might as well, right? Yeah, I don't know where my little hobbit buddy went though. Okay. Okay, he's not talking to me. So now just to close, which I'm assuming is this way. Just because there wasn't anything to do over here before, so. It makes sense. Oh, you know, melons, that's what it was, right? These melons will make fine substitutes for hobbit heads. Did I already get close? Yeah, I did. Hmm. Okay. Time to head back in. Like how I was supposed to escort the hobbit back, but he's not even like following me here. You should sleep, all of you. I'll keep watching the night. We leave at dawn. Where will we go? Toward Rivendell. But not by the main road. Ah, I should have known. More shortcuts and long delays. The last time we tried that, we were almost eaten by a tree. My shortcuts don't go wrong. Early the next morning, I led the four hobbits safely out of Bree and into the troll-haunted wilderness beyond. We approached the hill that the elves call Amon Sul and that men call Weathertop. All right, well, this will do for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Strider, what's that light? I'm not certain. It's too distant to make out. But it appears to be coming from Weathertop. It's like lightning. We'll know more once we reach Weathertop. We need to reach Weathertop's summit quickly. If Gandalf is following, he'll go there to look for us. We might find Gandalf there. The hope is faint, and he's even less likely to find us on the paths I take through the wilderness. Perhaps the Black Riders won't find us in the wilderness either. Frodo, Samwise, come with me. Lead the way, Aragorn. Come back to my Lord of the Rings, Fellowship of the Ring, let's play. Let's get right back into the game. And I did not mean to just run into that fire. All right. Looks like we're playing as this guy again, and we got all of our little uh, hobbit buddies following us around. Reach summit of Weathertop. Okay, don't know where that is, but I guess we'll just wander around until we find something. Once again, I've never been this far in this game, so like, I have no idea where to go. My hobbit team and following me. What the heck? Oh, it's a wolf. <laughs> it just jumped off. Oh, I can't hit it. Oh my god. That was BS. Sorry, buddy. You came at the wrong time. Alright. Um, there's another wolf up here. I don't know if I actually have to. Okay, that's not working. I wanted to see how much damage I would do, but it is not good enough to fight these things. Oh, 
All right. Let's just keep following this track or trail, whatever. Bro, these guys are just waiting to pounce on me. Yeah, that's right. Come on down. I saw you. Did he not die? No, he didn't. The other one's hiding behind the rock. Let me just finish this guy off. There we go. I hear you guys. You can't sneak up on me. Get some cram. Ooh, I see a little like ball in a castle thing in the background. Looks cool. Ow, I missed. No, what are you doing? Oh, you died. Might as well just do that, get some full health. Can I go up to the castle? Uh, that's probably where I'm heading. Hit this guy before that other one gets close to me. I don't even know how I hit that guy. Oh, okay, new enemies. Shooting bows at me. Thankfully, they shouldn't be too hard to outrun or to dodge, whatever. Okay, these guys aren't strong at all. Ow. Okay, cool. My hobbits are here to help. Can I push them off? No. Okay. Well, they're done for. I don't know how I do the thing where I like stab them when they're on the ground. Like, I don't know if that's just like a thing if they're like one hit. Okay. Did not me to do that. Get over here. Now you're trapped. All right. Oh, there's health over there. Actually, I should probably take care of this guy first. So I keep thinking I'm going to do it, but then I don't. Let's grab this bad boy and continue on. Cool little fortress here, though. Hey, buddy. Okay. So I probably just have to get close enough to them and do it, which is weird because I thought I was doing that before, but I guess not. How? Okay. Not really much room to dodge there. Thankfully, he gave me health back. Okay. Yeah, I guess you just have to get close enough. I'm just curious why it wasn't happening some other times when I did that, but... Oh, well. Whoa. Yeah, so much easier. Whoa, 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 whoa. Calm down, buddy. That's not what I wanted to do. That was a waste. Okay. Okay, I don't, I don't even know where I'm trying to hit. Uh, you look. Wait, I have a dagger? Or a longsword? Or, uh, that's what I've been using. Okay. The ruins of the tower look different from the last time I was here. As if a great struggle took place within them. Look at this cairnstone. There are runes on it. It appears to be a G and a three. G for Gandalf. And the three might mean a date. 
October 3rd was not long ago. Gandalf was here. If he was, he left in a hurry. Perhaps he ran into trolls. Or worse. <laughs> Looks like we got a boss fight. Also, I'm curious if anyone's like made it this far at least. Um, let me know if I've like missed anything in this game. Oh, was not expecting him to do that. Yeah, that was just me being dumb. Like, I feel like that last map was like wide open, so I feel like I could have missed something. So let me know if I did. Is that all? No finishers or anything? Look down there on the Great East Road, Dark Riders. <sighs> Merry and Pippin are down there. Back to the camp quickly. Frodo's wounded. I must protect him. No, Frodo. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why are you rushing up to him? I messed up by attacking two of them. Oops, that's not what I meant. Ow. Get away! Okay, I need to chill. Stay away. <laughs> you won't get to my photo. Ow. Yeah, stay away. Stay out of harm's way and stay close to Frodo. I'll follow the best I can. We'll take care of him. Don't you worry about that. All right, I'm going to go ahead and uh, pause it and save it real quick. All right, good and saved. All right, what are we doing now?
Scout ahead to clear a path for the hobbits. All right, you guys just stay behind me then. I mean, are these any different from the normal wolves I've been playing? Oh. I don't think so. I mean, they didn't seem like they took more damage than normal. Oh boy, another one, big guys. Oh, last one wasn't too bad. Just gotta watch out for his little spinny attack. That might be a problem. Ow. Okay. I just said I need to watch out for that and I'm not listening to myself. Okay, I ran right into it. Dude, how far do I need to get? Okay, I didn't mean to do that attack. Okay, I'm just playing bad now. I need to go sideways. I don't know why I'm having such a problem with this one. There we go. Yeah, that should not have been that hard, but it was for some reason. Hopefully I didn't have to go back for my little hobbit buddies. Ow. Just in case. Anybody else want to mess with me? You've seen what I've done to all your buddies in here. Oh, there's another guy. Ow. Ow. Couldn't really dodge that. Whoa, I am almost dead. I did not realize that. No, I can't deal with another person. Dude, he's locking on to the guy. Stab him. Thank you. Okay. That could have been way worse, but also better. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. I need to go deal with those guys first. Now. Dude. How, see, like that. I don't understand why sometimes it attacks them on Oh god, there's two of these guys. Give me a break, give me a break. Bro. Come on. Let me move at least. I need a better area. Dude, why can't they do damage to each other? Okay, got one, got one, got one. There we go. 
Let's go. Okay, that could have gone ten times worse. A rider approaches. So I see. I na vedui do na dan. An elf, my govan and melon. What did he just say? Well met, friend. Or at least I think so. This is Glorfindel of the House of Elrond in Rivendell. Hail and well met at last. We were told to look for you by Gandalf. No, Elrond received news of you from elves traveling near the Shire. As soon as he learned things were amiss, he sent out riders in all directions. Here, Frodo has a Morgul wound. He must get to Rivendell. Then he shall ride my horse, Asgoloth. His pace is smooth, and he'll let no rider fall from his back. Fly! The enemy is upon us! Fly to the ford! Ride on! Norolim! Norolim, Asgoloth! At Elrond's command, the waters of the River Bruinen swept the Ringwraiths away. We entered the hidden elven valley of Rivendell. Elrond, the Lord of Rivendell, healed the wound made by the Morgul blade. Frodo awoke to a familiar face. Alright, that'll do it for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Yes, I am here. And you are lucky to be anywhere, after all the absurd things you've done. Then we made it. But we needed you, Gandalf. I was held captive by the treachery of Saruman the White, the chief of the wizards. But now I am free, and astonished that you brought the ring all this way. Hobbit seemed especially resistant to the evil of the ring. Thank you for sending Aragorn. I didn't know he could fight ring wraiths. I thought he was only a ranger. Only a ranger? My dear Frodo, rangers are the last remnant of the kings of ancient Numenor, but now your part in the quest of Mount Doom is complete. You shall hear all about it in many meetings. You are to be the guest at the Council of Elrond. My friends, this is the Hobbit, Frodo, son of Droko. He has sacrificed much to bring the One Ring to Rivendell. Frodo, these are leaders of the free peoples of Middle-earth. Gimli, son of Glawin of the Dwarf Kingdom of Erebor, where the Dark Lord Sauron threatens invasion. Legolas, son of Thranduil, King of the Wood Elves. They fight Sauron's forces in Mirkwood Forest. Boromir, son of the Steward of Gondor. The men of Gondor suffer great losses to protect us all from Sauron's armies. Sauron's power is tied to this ring. We must carry it deep into Mordor and destroy it in the fires of Mount Doom. Destroy it? You would deliver our greatest weapon right to the doorstep of our enemy? We cannot use it. It corrupts all who bear it. The more powerful the bearer, the more dangerous they will become. I fear to take the ring to hide it. I will not take the ring to wield it. A dark riddle. Those powerful enough to enter Mordor dare not touch the ring. Powerful enough to enter Mordor? All the armies of Middle-earth joined together could not enter Mordor! A small force with stealth may succeed where a large army would fail. Elves have tried to join with dwarves against Sauron, but the dwarves prefer to hide in their dark caves counting their treasures. At least dwarves are not fleeing Middle-earth! But elves are sailing away to the safety of the West during our darkest hour! Enough! I say we use the ring as a weapon. 
or none of you is powerful enough to bear the ring to Mordor. I will take the ring, though I do not know the way. I think this task has been appointed for you, Frodo. If you do not find the way, no one will. You won't send him alone? No, indeed, since it is not possible to separate you from him, Sam Ganji. Gandalf shall lead a fellowship of free people against Sauron. Nine walkers against Sauron and his nine riders. Legolas shall be for the elves and Gimli for the dwarves. For men, there shall be Aragorn and Boromir of Gondor. For the remaining two, I shall call for great heroes, like... Merry and Pippin! Hobbits of free people, too! You cannot begin to imagine the danger ahead. Neither can Frodo, and neither can I. Even the greatest lords of the elves could not force open a passage through Mordor. I would rather trust Hobbit friendship than ancient power. Very well, then. The Fellowship of the Ring shall set forth to Mordor. All right, we got our teams ready. Um, also, because I don't actually remember, were Merry and Pippin in the movie or no? Because I, it's been forever since I've seen them, so I don't actually know. Anyways, we got the Fellowship of the Ring. Renewed shall be the blade that was broken. The crownless again shall be king. The elven smiths have reforged Narsil, the blade of my ancestors. You have done me a great honor. You do us honor to carry it against our common enemy, Aragorn, son of Arathorn, son of the kings of Numenor. It shall have a new name, Anduril, Flame of the West. May it see the end of the Dark Lord, and then see you safely back to me, my love. You have my thanks, Arwen Andumiel, and my love. My Govanan Menon. All right. Oh, I want to apologize, by the way. I think last episode I called him Aragorn, but it's Arag or Aragon, I call him, but it's Aragorn. Or two episodes ago, actually. Okay, what am I doing? Nothing, just talking to people. Anything for you guys? I mean, I pressed triangle, but I could have just missed him too. I don't know. Hello, Bilbo. It looks like we'll be going soon. I wanted to stop by and say goodbye. There you are, Frodo, my lad. I've some gifts for you, for use on the road ahead. First, there is Steenip, the blade of an elven prince. You'll need it, I wager. This is a mithril shirt from the dragon treasure. Very light, but stronger than any steel. Thank you for all you have done to help me. Help you? I brought a terrible doom upon you. I would take the silly old ring myself, but without it, the years have caught up with me. I'm not well preserved anymore as you once said the old that is strong does not wither you should heed your own words ah yes take care of yourself frodo and bring back all the news you can i'm writing a book about your adventure take care of yourself uncle bilbo i'll bring back all the news i can and old songs and tales as well it was december when we set forth on the road to mordor Traveling through the ancient land of Holland, we were beset on all sides by Sauron's power. For birds and beasts and even weather could be bent to the wheel of Sauron. The Dark Lord hurled a raging snowstorm as we tried to cross the great mountain Carathras. We forged on until an avalanche forced us to quit the mountain and seek another path. All right short episode but that'll do it for this episode if you enjoyed please feel free to leave a like comment subscribe it would really help me and i would really appreciate it anyways thank you for watching Carathras has defeated us should we turn back there is no safety for the ring in rivendell where do we go there is another path the mines of moria that is a name of ill omen but in gondor we will have strong allies the enemy expects that so the ring must not go near gondor I shall follow you to Moria, and look upon the great underground city of khazad -dûm. I will go, but I say to you all, beware the secrets of Moria. I will not go, unless the vote of the whole company is against me. The ring-bearer's voice should be heard. I do not wish to go, but I do not wish to forsake the Council of Gandalf either. We must reach Moria, and soon. Gandalf speaks true. Our troubles may get worse, and sooner than we like.
Welcome back everybody to my Lord of the Rings Fellowship of the Ring Let's Play. Let's get right into it and we get to play as Gandalf finally. Let's go. <clears throat> I'm happy we get to play as him. I was wondering if we were get, get, going to get to. Bleh. Hey. Get off of me. What's my... Oh, fireballs. Okay, so I can start doing that when they're down. Good to know. Uh, I'll wait a little bit more before I heal up. If that it's even like... Oh, I can change it too. But I think I have a limited mouse. So I probably shouldn't be swimming that. Okay, his... Like, weapon hitbox is not good. Yeah, that one's my bad. Ow. Okay. I need to find heals. Except I don't know what he can heal with. Because for the hobbits, it was mushrooms. But, but for Aragorn, it was the food. Hey, buddy. Ow. Oh my god, dude. Yep, that's not right. Wait, do I have a heal spell, actually? Uh, okay, I do. I'm so happy I checked that. Dude, I couldn't move. Okay, cool. Dude, why does it keep going for that guy? Okay. Okay, cool. Heal again. While I'm free. Okay. Where to go, where to go. Oh, okay. Did not expect to run into a guy turning the corner. Oh, I need to use one of these actually. Almost out of mana. Charge. I don't know if that's what he said or not. So it sounded like though. I wish I could like consistently attack these guys on the ground to like finish them off. Dude, he almost just knocked me off. There we go. Oh my god. Oh, he is not finished. Oh yeah, he is. He's had to let out one final growl. Okay, I think that's where I'm going. Whoa. Stay away from me. Is this where I go? Or can I fight this guy going this way? Can I drop his gun off? I guess not. Uh, can I walk in water? No, I think I have to go that way. Okay, let's just go this way. Don't take damage. I took a little bit of damage. So good to know there is fall damage in this game. Did not know that. Woo. Uh oh. Game like glitched out for a second. I'm gonna go after this guy real quick just so he's not annoying me. Might as well. If that is the end of the level, then it's fine if we use all this.
Oh, I already used it on hopes. Um, okay. They're all down. That wasn't too hard. Anyone else want to mess with me? Get off the grates. This was a really short level, by the way, if this is it. I think it is. We have come to the west gate of Moria. Here, the elven land of Holland ended. There is a gate here. Dwarf doors are not made to be seen when shut. Behold. What does the writing say? It reads, The doors of Dudin, Lord of Moria. Speak, friend, and enter. What does it mean, speak, friend, and enter? If you are a friend, speak the password to open the doors. Do you know the word, Gandalf? If I am allowed a bit of peace, I shall seek for the word. Okay, was not expecting that to be honest. Oh no, I'm not even getting off. Ow. Ow. I don't know if this is what I'm supposed to be doing. How about aim for his head? Yeah, I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here. Okay, I think you got it. Okay, that wasn't too bad. I thought that was gonna be a lot uh, harder. But anyways, actually, I'll just let this next that scene play before I end it. Let us rest while we can. How long will it take to get through this place? I cannot say for certain. Three or four days march. Providing we don't get lost or run into trouble. Trouble? Uh, what kind of trouble? Orc trouble. Moria is vast and deep. With luck, we can avoid all the orcs. Our luck seems to be running sour of late. Perhaps you would have preferred to remain behind with that thing in the lake? Uh, not me, Mr. Gimli. Not that thing or those wolves. I'll take my chances in here. All right, that'll do it for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my Lord of the Rings Fellowship of the Ring Let's Play. Let's get right back into it. Playing as Gandalf again in the mines. What was that? Am I gonna be finding like skeletons or something? I'm hearing noises. Jesus. Just dodge him and go right for this guy. Otherwise, he's gonna annoy us. Alright, at least we got a buddy with us this time. There we go. Unfortunately, we only have one guy, but he's a dwarf. He should be uh, fine. Oops, I ran right into that. Oh my god, so many arrows! Alright, there we go. Come on, let me do it to this guy. Okay, never mind, he died. Uh, I need to heal, actually. And once again, pass this guy, go for this archer. Boom. Did. Alright, 
moving on to the next room. I was trying to activate switches. Ah, oh, not this thing. Alright. I kind of wish they gave him like potions or something to be able to like heal it. It's because it's faster. I don't have to like go switch through my spells and stuff. Oh, but I am lagging. At least got two of them off. Oh. Hello? What's he what's he blocking with? Was I just like hitting his bow on his back or something? That was weird. Oh wait, I got food. Okay, so I guess you can pick up stuff. Did not realize that before. Actually, I'm curious how much uh Magic the healing spell takes. Like, does it just go down however much help that it gives me? The heck? How'd you get there? Dude. Okay, I guess he's dead. That's probably why it wasn't working. Let me up there. It's gonna make me come down here, turn around, and come back up. There's one down. I kinda wish it'd be cool if I got both of them. Okay. Oh! He said like a finisher, but it didn't kill him. Big bridge. Oh my god. Get across. And I'm dead. Move out of my way, buddy. Meh. No, I ran right into it. Come on, use your fisher or not. Oh, cool. Well, that wasn't too bad. Uh, looks like there's. Oh, no, not that way. Never mind. As I say, it looks like there's a couple ways to go. But I was wrong. Get him before he shoots. Thank you, dude. Okay, I think he's done for the count. Got some cram. Ah, oh, I was hoping my buddy would come here faster. Okay, I'll let him deal with him while I just run right into this guy's arrow. It looks like there's a few ways to go here this time. Ow. All right. Give me the bread. What was this area for? Just the bomb bad guys on me? Okay, there's something right here. Oh, I missed it. Oh, it's just potion stuff. Alright, looks like there's really nothing over here. What about across the way? I mean, I'm assuming we go down that pathway, but I just want to clear everything out just in case I miss something. Okay, never mind. I guess this was a dead end. I just. Okay. Moving on. <laughs>
Pause it for a second. Hey. Alright. Just heal that little bit of health up real quick before we continue on. Did they just like copy and paste the levels? Like the stories? Move. Get them. They're annoying. Hey, you go for him. I'll go for this guy. Can't get away from me, buddy. I'm starting to think these rooms don't have anything. So if I see it like that, then don't go there. All right, this looks like a way to go. I just heard a scream. Ow. Get him. Come on. Oh, okay, I didn't want to do it. Why is it not working? I guess I'm just dying. I don't know. Okay, that time I don't know why I didn't work. Stop shooting me. Aim for that guy. Oh, you're my teammate. Whoops. Grab this real quick. Ow. The hobbits need rest, Gandalf. This seems like a sound place to camp. I agree. This is as good a place as any nearby. Very well, Gimli. We shall camp here, but not for long. Orcs are on the prowl. I've been muted, apparently. Don't know how long I've been muted. But uh, yeah, I died. I had to replay the last two levels because it's been a while since I last uh, saved, I guess. I 
So yeah, I am unfortunately missing some like heals and stuff that I would have gotten if I didn't speed run. That's all good. I'm not worried about it. I I pressed backwards, but my guy didn't turn. Isn't it finish him? Oh well. Um, probably should heal real quick. All right, back to this room. Oh, we're not quite there yet. Never mind. Oh, I almost just died again. Yeah, right, watch this. Okay. Now we are officially back to where I was when I stupidly ran into this little circle. What I was trying to do was to look down there, but I'm dumb. I also didn't see that switch last time. Stop screaming at me. looks more like a way to go since I had to pull a lever for it. And probably the way with the bridge. <clears throat> Come on. Just finish up. Come on. Take it, we're not going this way. I don't really want to risk trying to. Oh, yeah, I can't even jump with Gandalf. Never mind. So I guess we have to go this way. Bruh. Okay, maybe I just went the wrong way. <clears throat> I guess the switch way was not the way to go. I mean, there's another lever, I guess. Oh. Is that where I just came from? No, it can't be. It's not the right direction. Move. I wonder what that area was for then. I'm not certain, but I think something is following us quietly in the dark. Well, that's creepy. Oh, <laughs> the best character in the whole series. <laughs> the precious. Can I follow him? No. I guess he's just wandering around through the little windows. Just before I go. No, nope, that's not way. Get out of here. Stop shooting me! Oh, 
Okay. That was a little bit close. They can handle the rest. I think it was just the one guy. Oh god. Yeah. I freaked out. I don't want it to fling me in the little hole in the ground. Ow. No, I'm stuck in the corner. Do not want to be stuck in the corner. And then use the rest of it. All right, never mind. All right. Oh, that's taken care of. I was a little bit scared there. Okay. So we do go back that way. So I technically was right. <laughs> Just couldn't quite go over there yet. I just hiccuped. I don't know if you guys heard that or if I muted it in time. Alright, give me the loot and the bread. And now we make our way back. Definitely feel like this is a longer mission. And again, that could just be because I had to replay a lot of it. Or the past three missions, I should say. All right, make our way all the way back to the side. <clears throat> Is it this turn? I think so. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Going the right way still. Open the door. Three passages? This place looks so cool. I mean, it's very dark, but like, if you can see the whole thing, I bet it would be really cool. Dude, why? It's like he pulls out his little knife sword thing and then just stands there. Right through the armor. There's a skeleton hanging on the wall. Up. Uh, anything over here? Nope. Just glitched up on the little table. <laughs> I wish my little uh, dwarf buddy can finish him off like that. He does hit down on him. But it doesn't seem to like actually kill them. All right, at least he took out that guy for me. Did you just take all those arrows? Nice, buddy. You stopped him. So proud of you. Come on. Okay, he's dead anyways. That big door. Maybe that means a boss.
Is my game broken or is this just taking forever for no reason? <laughs> oh, I guess we'll just sit here and wait. Looks like a good place to rest. Stay away from that well, though. Who knows what is swimming around down there, looking for a meal? Well, you're a small catch, Sam. It would probably throw you back. Pippin, that's not a... Good idea. Fool of a took. Throw yourself in next time, and we'll be done with you. Listen, what's that sound? It sounds like a hammer. Someone down there is sending signals. We'll need to move on, and soon, before the orcs come. All right, it was not a boss. All right, which way do I go? Let's take with the right side. All right, he can do it, that guy. I'm gonna go for this bow. All right, got him. Oh my god, he almost just hit me off. <laughs> me hitting that guy just dodged the bow. Go fight anyone else while I do this. No, oh, did I pick the right way? Let's go. The exit draws near. Soon the mines of Moria will be safely behind us. I hope you're right, as do I. I grow weary of this place. It is so cold and dark. Where are we exactly, Mr. Gandalf? I believe we're in the upper halls. Perhaps the 20th or 21st. They've been well looted, and of little interest to the orcs. They prefer the lower levels, despite the shadow of fear that covers them. Uh, fear of what? Durin's Bane. A dark creature unleashed long ago by dwarves seeking Mithril. They delve too greedily and too deep. Enough talk of the past. It is the present that concerns me. Do we rest, or move on? I don't think we have a choice. Cave trolls! <laughs> Oh boy. <laughs> Gotta fight two again. You'll have to handle the trolls. I'll find a way to get us out of here. For the Shire. Okay, I guess I'm not fighting him. For the Shire. What's this? Oh. Alright. I don't know exactly what I'm looking for. Nope. Uh, it looks like there might be something to do with that, like, statue in the middle. This thing. Oh, laser puzzle. Can I push this stuff? Um, whoops, that's not what I meant to do. This maybe? No. Lightning. Attract our hit with magic assault. Become stronger of their own kind. Heal. Okay, no. I was curious if I could push these things onto these things. Whoops. Okay, I am really confused on what I'm supposed to be doing right now. Ok. 
Can I just like help these guys fight real quick? Oops. Okay, I guess I don't want my help at all. Okay. I gotta figure out what to do with these, uh, that she thinks. Like, do I have to do it in the correct order? Can I see these things? Okay, let's point to that. I don't know if that means anything though. Okay, I might just have to pause while I like figure this out. Yeah, I'm gonna pause while I figure this out. Okay, okay. If you walk up to these things and hold triangle, you can push them. I need to remember, I need to press the triangle. <laughs> I keep forgetting to press it to like interact with things for some reason. Don't worry guys, I'm trying. All right. Objective complete. Now where do I go though? Is this open? This show me what to do. I wasn't really looking. Find the passage through whatever. That's what I've had. <clears throat> I really need to start like paying attention more. Oh, uh, does this door? I thought we came in this way. Maybe not. The book is a record of Balin's time in Moria. I fear the tidings are grim indeed. They met with early fortune, driving out a host of goblins. Then they discovered Mithril. The riches of Moria. It goes on to tell of Balin's death, an attack by orcs. Slowly but surely, the dwarves were driven back and trapped. The last lines read, We cannot get out. The end comes. Drums. Drums in the deep. They are coming. They made their last stand here. The effort to retake Moria was valiant, but foolish. Should be moving on. Frodo, I fear the enemy is near. I will slay the foul beasts with my axe should they attack. Let us pass through this hall and find the others on the other side. I will do my best to offer my assistance. All right, back to Frodo. Get off looks the like a giant compared to it everyone else. Into the hall. There must be a way to open it. There must be a way to open it. Let's figure out that way. Okay. Bro, stay here. Dude, I have no range. Holy crap. I just need to run. Oh my god, I was scared that I was going to die there. 
I didn't jump. Okay. Okay. Attempt number two. Okay, I made it. That was close. Dude. This is getting quite annoying. Okay, at least I saw like the mushrooms. I don't know if those carry over or if they just give it to me. Now that I know there is fall damage in this game, I'm not just going to run off. Oh my god. Alright. Has this guy actually killed any of them yet or no? Does not look like it. As long as they're on him though, that's fine, right? Although I should probably help him. I don't want him to be just stuck in this room. Ow. Oh no, he's good now. There we go. Come on, buddy. Er, uh, I gotta go this way across the bridge. I don't know if you can jump. Frodo, this bridge needs to Never be. Never mind. I guess we do go the other way. Wait, how close is that? No. Can I hit this guy? I can, but I don't think that does any damage. Okay, how do I cross this then? I'm gonna save it real quick. Alright. We're all saved. And when I got out, I just realized there's this lever here. Definitely sent me a lot of time. I was about to run all the way around. Okay, you can fight them. Don't let me tell you now. Dude, I hate how I don't have range. Dude, are you kidding me, game? Thankfully, I had a save there that I just did. Ooh, red. I just need to keep running so these guys can't hit me. Go, go, go. Why are you running towards me, not the guy with the sword? Another bridge to be crossed. The switch. I see it on the other side. You must get to the switch, Master Frodo, so that I may cross. Okay, I was just saying, can I go up this or no? He can handle himself. He's a fighter. Bro, this is a long. Come on. <laughs> Bro, how high am I going? Jesus. Longest ladder ever. There we go. Oh, the crappy thing is, is now I'm by myself. No. Run past. Oh, wait, no, I should probably fight these guys now. I thought this. Wait, did I even equip it? I don't know which one's better. Okay. Dude, 
This is so annoying. I'm just gonna run. Get out of here. I'm gonna have to pull a lever though or something. Oh, no, never mind. It's just a ladder. Okay, so better to run past these guys. Okay, thank God. I was really worried that I wasn't gonna be able to get on there by the time he hits me. Just another hour long ladder. Almost there. I can hear them fighting. <clears throat> yeah, this is definitely going to be like a really extra long episode. I guess I'll go help him with this last guy. Okay, he's dead. Oh. I see these guys just popped out of Go, go, go. I'm just around past them. Go, go, go. No, no, no. No. Okay, that was really dumb of me. Okay. Okay, I made it back here. These guys are kind of fighting on the bridge. And I can't really pass safely. No, dude. I freaking went through the ground. Okay, finally got past him. I just thought my guy fed on the bridge for a while. Until there was like one left and then I just ran past. Now, is there a boss fight? That looks like a boss door to me. Face the Balrog alone. I am a servant of the secret fire, wielder of the flame of Anor. You cannot pass. Okay. How on earth am I supposed to fight this thing? Dude. How am I supposed to fight this? Go, go, go. Dude, how am I supposed to fight this thing? Look at me back here. I do want the lightning thing. Get away! Okay, reset. Run away! Alright, this might take forever. Because I don't know how much health this guy actually has. Okay. Reset. That sucks. Okay, let's get a heal off. Get down. Take this. 
Take what? What do you want to give me? All right, I need to. That was just my bad. I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna do this real quick. That's probably a waste, but uh. Was close so it has to kind of be three hits only run away glad i'm freaking gandalf during this and not proto with his little dagger otherwise i won't even be able to touch this thing I'm like fighting the camera, that's why it looked weird there. Take, this. Take what? You're not giving me anything. I'll do one more. Take this. Bro, take what? You're not giving me anything. Okay, dude, are you kidding me? I have to do that all again? You cannot pass. We forged on, out of the dark depths of Moria, and soon we reached the Golden Wood, Lothlorien. Alright, that'll do it for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. I have not been here for many long years, but I remember the way to Karaskalothan, Tree City of the Elves. Elves! Be at ease. I am Haldir of Lorien. I have been following you for some time. You breathe so loud, I could shoot you in the dark. Huh? Have no fear. The Lady Galadriel is expecting you. But the Dwarf is not permitted on our land. But Elrond chose him. He's brave and faithful. Very well. But he must travel blindfolded. I am no spy. I will not walk blind like a prisoner. My people do not serve the enemy. This is our law. I will go forward free. A plague on dwarves and their stiff necks. Hold. We will all go blindfolded. Ha ha ha! A merry troop of fools we shall look. I will be content if Legolas shares my blindness. But I am an elf. I am a kinsman here. Shall we say a plague on elves and their stiff necks? The company shall all fare alike. Bind us all, Haldir. So be it. I shall lead you safely to Karos Galothan, where Lord Celeborn and Lady Galadriel await you. Gandalf the Grey set out with your company. Where is he now? Alas, Lady. Gandalf fell into shadow. He did not escape Moria. In all the long years full of grievous tidings, these are the most evil. When escape seemed beyond us, he saved us, and he fell. We will hear the tale another day, for you are weary and heart sick. We will do what we can to help you, especially the one who bears the burden. Your quest stands upon the edge of a knife. Stray even a little, and it will fail to the ruin of all. Yet, hope remains while all the fellowship is true. Rest, and we will not speak of the road ahead for a while.
Welcome back to my Lord of the Rings Fellowship of the Ring Let's Play. Let's get right into it. I believe this is a uh, shorter uh, mission, by the way. We will not speak of the road ahead for a while. Your quest stands upon the edge of a knife. Stray even a little, and it will fail to the ruin of all. So, uh, yeah, we're just gonna walk around and talk to people. I've never seen too such sure beauty. This elvish lady and her purposes. The Lady Galadriel. It surprises me to say this, but she is fair beyond belief. Indeed, there is no one fairer in any land. Mm. Did you try these elven delicacies? I've never tasted anything like it. Imagine spending thousands of years perfecting your recipes. To think, Frodo, all of this, built in and upon great trees, it's marvelous, truly marvelous. I wonder if I shall see any elf magic while we're here. The elves sing a lament for Gandalf. I share their grief. There is no evil in this land or its people, unless a man brings it here himself. All right, I believe that is everyone to talk to in this room at least. Here is the mirror of Galadriel. I have brought you here to look in it, if you will. What will we see? Things you desire to see, and things unbidden. Things that were, are, and may yet be. I'll have a peek. There's only stars. Wait, what? it's Ted Sandyman cutting down all our trees. I'll cut him down. Oh, devilry. They've dug a bagshot row. They've run off my old gaffer. I have to go to the Shire. Would you turn from Frodo's quest? No. Do you wish to look now, Frodo? I will look. I see a land in shadows and an old man walking toward me. Gandalf? No. White robes. Saruman? There's the sea. A tall ship from the west and a white fortress. With seven towers, another ship, with black sails, and the emblem of a white tree, I see a great battle, and an eye, ringed with fire. I know what you saw, for it is in my mind as well. But the enemy cannot hurt you here. This land is not preserved merely by singing or arrows. Behold, Nenya, the Ring of Adamant. A ring Sauron cannot rule, unless you fail, and he gains the ring. We would be laid bare before him, yet, if you succeed, my power will diminish, and Lothlorien will fade. Which do you choose, lady? My love for my people is deeper than the sea, yet I would cast it all away rather than submit to Sauron. I wish you to destroy the ring. I would give you the ring. If you ask for it. You would give me the ring freely? In place of the Dark Lord, you would set up a queen. And I shall not be dark, but beautiful and terrible as the morning and the night. All shall love me and despair. No, I pass the test. I will diminish and go into the West. And remain Galadriel. Lady Galadriel? You wear one of the rings of power. When I wear the one ring, why can't I see into your mind or the minds of others? Because you have not tried. But I warn you not to. You would have to become far stronger and train your will to the domination of others. And then you would lose the one virtue that makes you more able to resist the ring than any of the wise and powerful. We will not speak more of it. Let us go. The next day we said farewell to Lorien. Celeborn and Galadriel gave us boats of elven make, and we set out on the great river Anduin toward Mordor. All right, that'll do it for this episode. I know that was quick and not really much gameplay, but that does count as a level, so that'll do it for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching.
Aragorn has been gone for some time. I hope his scouting goes well. It is not Aragorn that concerns me, but you. You have a difficult path ahead. Yes. I know what I should do, but I'm afraid of doing it. And yet, do you suffer needlessly? I know you wish me to bear the ring to Gondor, and it seems like wisdom, except for the warning in my heart. What warning is that? A warning against the easy path, against the refusal of my burden, and if it must be said, against trust and strength and truth of the big people of the world. Our strength has long protected your little shire. I do not doubt the valor of Gondor, but what if it is not enough? There is still hope that Gondor will not fall. There is no hope while the ring exists. Yes, the ring. We can use its power for good. All that is done with the ring turns to evil. All can be corrupted. Some faster than others. Frodo, Boromir, make ready. The orcs have built fortifications. What would you have us do? Wake the others and prepare to move out. Stealth may not serve us here. We may have to fight. Think of my counsel, Frodo. It is all I ask of you. Welcome back to my Lord of the Rings Fellowship of the Ring. Let's play. Let's get right back into it. I didn't read what that said, actually. Uh, clear the river's edge of enemies. Let's go. Okay, lots of fighting. We've got a good crew behind us, though. No offense, but it's not just the hobbits. Okay, this guy just dodges all my arrows. Ow. Oh god. Okay, one's down. Ow. Oh, I don't have any heals. That's not good. Oh. Okay. They're all done for. Um, please let me find some heals. Hello, this guy, I think he's just like bread and stuff. What is all that about? Holy crap. Probably shouldn't just stand here. That's not the attack I wanted. Well, it probably does better damage. Oh god. No, 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 no. I definitely forgot to save before this mission, so I'm really hoping I don't die. Okay, bread. Thank you. So, do I have to be the one that does the final attack on these guys? Yeah. I forgot. I didn't do three on this guy. Sometimes I don't know when he's doing like the whole spinny thing or not. Okay, more health. Let's go. Okay, I don't think me hitting it has anything to do with it. Boom. Yeah. He got hit by his own team. And I just ran into that. Whoops. Don't shoot, don't shoot, don't shoot, don't shoot. Okay, he didn't shoot until I was actually like not moving. That's not the attack I want. I don't know why he keeps doing that. Okay, cool. Uh, probably have to use this. There we go. Not too bad. It's so much easier with these guys following me. Let me go this way. Uh, I guess it doesn't matter. Ow. I just ran right into it. Finish him. Our 
Did I go back now? Oh, okay. Well, that'll do it for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. This is my fault. That ring wraith mistook Sam for me. I must make amends. No, Frodo. We must distract the creature while they rescue our comrade. Baruch Gazad, to battle! Welcome back to my Lord of the Rings Fellowship of the Ring Let's Play. Let's get right into the game. Actually, first, before I do anything, I'm going to save just in case I die. All right, let's continue on with the game now. Uh, before I move on, normally they have heals around here, but I guess they don't this time. All right, so we got to go help our buddy Sam. He just got kidnapped by a dragon. Am I supposed to go up that way or is that just a spawn? Dude, I'm like elevated up so it's not like hitting it. Looks like they're fighting over there. Which I should probably help. Oh, he died already. Cool. Okay, where to go? Looks like I can go up over here. No. I definitely can't be taking stupid shots like that. Oh, he's not dead. I fought a dragon like this. You can't hit me. Okay, so that's just three shots in general for those guys. I wonder if that's how they calculate like damage and stuff in these older games. Like instead of actually having like an HP bar, if it's just like how many times you hit them. Dude, why do you do that as heck? Okay, cool. More bread. Is there anything around this little campfire? Yes, there is. Okay, cool. I gotta start looking for these. I'd have been very upset if that got me killed. Oh god. Stop blocking! Thank you. And he gave me bread to heal up. Bro, so many. Oh, these guys aren't too bad. Okay. Probably shouldn't just stand still though. Dude, I hate how that... Like, I, I understand it takes a second to pull out a sword. Okay. Just, I had to just sink those. Yeah, that I just ran up on them, which probably would have been better, but, uh, yeah. Oh, God. Big boy. Ooh, two breads. Oh, my God, there's two big boys. Dude, I don't know if I've had this. I gotta kind of pick and choose my battles. Dude, 
why I do not attack. Oh, that was almost a hit. Ow. Dude. You make me waste my bread. Okay. Not too bad. I got them all. Another one. I don't know why they're making such a big entrance for this one. Maybe I had to fight them. Otherwise, this guy probably wouldn't have come out. Oops. Dude. This stupid elevation thing. That was just my bad. Thank you. Please tell me there's more health around here somewhere. Dude, don't even. I'm just gonna run. I don't have the health to- Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! Maybe I don't run. Come on, game. Be nice to me. I'm gonna die. Yep, I'm gonna die. Cause... Yeah. I figured. All right, I'll be back. All right, made it back here and killed all the enemies. And now we got to deal with these guys. Where were they? Can I shoot you? Yes, I can. Okay, that take care of that guy. No, they're going to shoot me. Okay, that guy can't see me, I guess. Wonder if I can shoot this guy. I don't know exactly where he was. I don't think so, though. I think it goes right over his head. Come on. Hit the guy. Is that not hitting him? I guess not. Oh, I did get that guy. It was like in front of us. Okay, yeah, that's definitely not working. Do I have to just fall? Okay, why are you not dying? <laughs> Is he invincible? What the heck? Alright, looks like we got another one of these guys. I can move. Dude. Just do a normal attack, please. Oh my god. Used up more uh, heals than I've wanted to. Although I do see a full heal right here, which is pretty nice. Frodo, I'll hold 
off the orcs. Climb to the top. I'll follow when I can. Oh boy. Get to play as Frodo here who can't really hit. Wait, am I going backwards? Is there a secret this way? What's his health stuff look like? Okay. It's cool that that kind of carries over. Uh, I guess there's just two different ways to get here. Uh, I don't want to fight these guys as Trado because his attack sucks. Has no range whatsoever. I shouldn't be wandering off like this. No. I'm just trying to look for like health and stuff. Not that it really matters because I don't even know. I guess I have enough for now. Speed run it. It's gonna suck when I get up here and then I realize I do have to fight all these guys. The bread. Ow. Stop following me. Stay back there. You don't want to mess with me, huh? Oh, you know what? I can just put this on. Run past all these guys. I totally forgot about this. The Lord of the Rings and I forgot about the ring. <laughs> I gotta make it there with him. Oh no, that is not what I wanted to do. That was health taken away that I did not want it taken away from. Dude, no! I just realized I picked up the health as Frodo. That means I, it probably won't be there now. Dang it, dude. I only have one bread, which I kind of have to use. The reason I'm so worried is because I'm guessing that there's going to be boss fight here soon with the dragon. Since they took our boy Sam. Oh god. Stay away from me. Stay away from me. You see all that dodginess. Okay. Please tell me it respawned for whatever reason. It did not. Okay. That really sucks. I just didn't think I'd have to run through here again. Ow. Ow. Let me pass. No more shooting me. Please, please. I said no more. Thank God. No. Okay. I thought it was going to make me fight them. The boss battle. It's not my first rodeo with the dragon. Get him! Does this guy not attack back? What the heck? I guess he does a little bit. But for the most part, it seems like I can just do this. Get him! This can't be the whole battle, right? On God. Okay, yeah. I was gonna say that would be way too easy. Where's he at, though? It still shows that there are enemies around. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Where is this guy? They just flying around? 
Get him, snipe him. He's still shooting his green stuff. There he is. Get him, get him, get him. Some practice for the Minecraft boss. Hey, this is where they got their inspiration for that. Oh god. I did not shoot something. I thought I saw it shoot something. Where's it at? Right there. Now let us finish the foul beast. Did I do it or did I die? I think I did it. Okay, I thought I just died there. Fellowship of the Ring has triumphed. They have brought low the flying ring wraith. They have taken Frodo in safety to the very edge of Mordor. So the Fellowship has succeeded. Yet I see the ring bearer alone as he crosses into the dark land. Yet, not all alone. Okay, I guess that was it. Anyways, if you enjoyed this video or the series in general, please feel free to leave a like, comment, subscribe. It would really help me and I would really appreciate it. I really enjoy playing these older games. But uh, yeah, thank you for watching.